This device is made by the automatic telephone electric company in Liverpool, England. And the device is called the Witmatic. Good day viewers, here we got one of the very rare Witmatic load control devices. And I managed to get the thing to work. There's not many of these around on the network. And it works. It's quite amazing. This was used in the old days for control for hot waters, fixed uh, heating in houses and possible tariff changes. An obsolete system now uh, which runs at a very non-standard frequency and it's been superseded with cell vigors and uh, other devices. But uh, it works and I'll get you a close up on this uh, shortly. Here we have the on oscillation coil and it needs to get the right ripple and it will energize the device. There we go. Off. And now we go to the other one. That's the off uh, contact device. It's awesome, simply awesome this device. Almost later. Here's some of the nameplate data. I'm going to set this device up in another video with a tariff control on a meter and all the other things. So, and at the moment for driving it, I use one of these Tecos, or it's stepper, heavy duty stepper motor. Works quite well actually. Produces a nice uh, sine wave. And it seems to be quite nice uh, to drive this device here. Um, as I have no schematic, I just managed to work out how the thing works. And I directly inject the AC uh, frequency onto the calls. It's a cool device, really cool device. Visible here are the auxiliary contacts, little copper contacts. They determine what status. And the main contacts. Are we ready for this? We're totally ready for this. I mean, the fact that we're growing is so great. The Energize device. 